Hello friends! Today we will see how the actors of Rush Hour movie have changed. You can compare how they were looked then and now. The Rush Hour franchise is a series of American action comedy films. All three films center around a pair of police detectives, Inspector Lee and Detective James Carter. Detective James Carter, Chris Tucker, is one of the main protagonists of the Rush Hour films. He is detective for the Los Angeles Police Department in Los Angeles and is Inspector Lee's partner and friend. Carter appears in all three Rush Hour films. Sang, Ken Loon, is the right-hand man of Jintao. Sang first appears while on a barge ship near Hong Kong Harbor, where other Jintao people collect some stolen artifacts, representing years of Chinese heritage. Thomas Griffin, more commonly known as Gentile, Tom Wilkinson. He was a triad's leader that smuggled priceless pieces of Chinese culture out of the country. When Lee followed his operation, he threatened Chinese consul Solon Han by abducting his daughter. Luke Clifton Powell owns a bar and runs a criminal organization that involves selling weapons. Carter and Lee come to his bar and confront him in the back room. Carter pulls out his revolver and acts aggressively towards Luke and his men. Warren Ross is a special agent of the FBI, hired by Consul Han to help him save his daughter from the triads. He hires James Carter for the assignment and enlists him with Lee to get the case solved. He is supported by Mike Ralston. Solon Han is the Chinese consul. He has a daughter named So Young. He is portrayed by Tsi Ma. Han was a Chinese consul in the diplomatic area of Hong Kong. He was also friends with Hong Kong Police Force Detective Inspector Lee. Dan Whitney, Rex Lin, is an FBI agent and was Consul Han's bodyguard. He is portrayed by Rex Lin. His favorite quote was take a hike to Lee and Carter, telling them to get lost when they are trying to persuade the FBI not to enter the building. Detective Tanya Johnson was James Carter's partner in the LAPD. She specialized in bomb diffusion and appeared in Rush Hour. Tanya Johnson is the LAPD's bomb squad expert and sometimes partner to Carter. She is portrayed by Elizabeth Pena. Captain William Deal, Philip Baker Hall, is Carter's boss. Deal makes his first appearance while talking on the phone to FBI agent Dan Whitney about having someone for the G-14 classified case and assignment to babysit Detective Inspector Lee. Clive Cobb is a bomb maker that was selling explosive C-4 to undercover Detective James Carter. When two cops interrupted the sale, Clive fled only to be chased down by Carter and have this car destroyed. He is supported by Chris Pan. Chief Inspector Lee, Jackie Chan, is one of the two main protagonists of the Rush Hour series. He is a chief inspector for the Hong Kong Police Force HKPF. He is partnered with Detective James Carter, who was at first shunned him but later admires him. Ricky Tan, John Lone, was the former best friend and partner to Lee's father while working for the Hong Kong Police Force. Lee's father discovered that he was betraying the police force and working for the triads. Tan confronted and killed him. Isabella Molina, Rosalind Sanchez, is a US Secret Service agent and is Lee's love interest. Isabella first appears on Ricky Tan's yacht. When Carter sees her, he is immediately smitten with her, saying that his yacht is her yacht. Sterling is a US Secret Service agent. Sterling first appears at the Yao Mai T police station, talking with Captain Chin about the ongoing investigation into the bombing at the American Embassy. He is portrayed by Harris Ewing. 
Zin, Ernie Reyes Jr. is a member of Triad. Lee and Carter paid a visit to the ring plaza where they introduced themselves to Zin, realizing that he has been exposed. Zin rushes over to the back of the plaza while pursued by an angry Lee and Carter. Red Dragon Boxman is have cameo appearances as a Versace salesman, casino boxman and Pit. He is portrayed by Saul Rubinick. At that time he was 53, now 71. Q Lee is the right-hand henchwoman of Ricky Tan. Q Lee first appears at the beginning of the film, disguised in a blonde wig and holding a package while walking into an office building at the American Embassy. She is ported by Zhang Ziyue. Steven Rain is the owner of the Rain Towers Hotel in Los Angeles and is also the owner of the Red Dragon Casino in Las Vegas. Steven Rain is first seen on Ricky Tan's yacht in the middle of Hong Kong Harbor. He is ported by Alan King. Captain Chin, Kenneth Tang, is Lee's superior and boss. Captain Chin first appeared calling Lee and telling him that there was a bombing at the American Embassy that killed two translators. He asked if Lee would like to solve this case. Kenny, Don Cheadle, is an old friend of James Carter. He owns a Chinese restaurant that sells Chinese soul food and is also married to a Chinese woman who he has children with. He is also revealed to be an expert at the twisting tiger technique. Minister Warden Rainer, Max von Zudo, is the French ambassador and chairman of the World Criminal Court. Rainer was close friends with Han, but Han himself was completely unaware that Rainer would betray him to work for Kenji's organization. George Evan Ethel is a French taxi driver. At first, he shows prejudice against Americans, but later on, he became the new sidekick of Lee and Carter and becomes very pro-American, as he believes that being American is very exciting and fun. Genevieve, Nomi Leonard, is Ambassador Han's contact to recall that Shai Shen is Ambassador Han's contact to recall what Shai Shen is and is also the love interest of Carter. She first appeared at the club where Carter and Lee were fighting Shai Shen. Solon Han is the Chinese consul. He has a daughter named So Young. He is portrayed by Tsi Ma. Han was a Chinese consul in the diplomatic area of Hong Kong. He was also friends with Hong Kong Police Force Detective Inspector Lee. Hinji is a triad leader. He was the Japanese foster brother of Chief Inspector Lee, growing up in the same Chinese orphanage. He was also the villain that attempted to assassinate Ambassador Solon Han. He is portrayed by Hiroyuki Sanada. So Yang Han is the Chinese consul Song Han's daughter. She is 11 years old in the first Rush Hour film. So Yang showed some Kung Fu skills when she was a kid fighting off Sang as he first attempted to abduct her. She is portrayed by Julia Hu. So Yang Han, Zhang Jinchu, is the Chinese ambassador Han's daughter. She returns in Rush Hour 3, now all grown up at age 21. Her father, now an ambassador, was the victim of an attempted assassination by Lee's Japanese foster brother Kenji. Dragon Lady Jasmine was a triad assassin. Jasmine was another assassin that worked for Kenji's organization. She had a bunch of sharp weapons in her geisha robe, including deadly knives and daggers. She is supported by Yoki Kudo. Sister Ragnus, Dana Ivy, is a nun working at the hospital where a solemn hand is taken care of after the assassination attempt by Kenji. Agnes is brought in as the translator when Lee and Carter capture a triad assassin that only speaks French. 
Sun Mingming is a basketball player from China. He has appeared in Russia all three years, Kung Fu Giant. It was at this point Carter knew he'd taken it too far as the giant hung Carter up by the back of his neck and proceeded to absolutely destroy Carter along with Lee. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please share it on social networks, like it, and of course subscribe to the channel.